Hi guys, welcome back. Today's video is a battle of the cheap beauty blenders. So we are talking about the Daiso beauty blender, the Mini Soul beauty blender, and the Isleway beauty blender. So all of these beauty blenders are less than 100 pesos or less than $2. So the Daiso beauty blender is 88 pesos or around a dollar and fifty. The mini so beauty blender is ninety nine pesos, so around two dollars. And the Isle Away beauty blender is around ninety nine pesos or two dollars for two pieces. The other piece is shaped like this. While Mini Saw also has beauty blenders that are shaped like this and I've already reviewed them in a previous video and I'll put up a card here so that you can check that out. This video is specifically about these new sponges all of these are new new products from isle away miniso and Dyson. so as soon as i got my sponges yesterday i already tried them last night and today and i have come to a decision so the worst sponge out of the three but i'm not saying that it's bad it's just not the best out of the three it's the least good out of the three is the Dyson blending sponge it's firm a lot firmer than the other two and it also expands the most compared to the other two so it's the biggest in size but when they're dry they're all the same size and i also noticed that it absorbed the most product out of the three it's a bit patchy when it blends it's just not the best but it works it reminds me of the everbilena um blend me sponge it kind of feels the same but in a bigger size now between Isleway and minisol the difference is a bit less obvious but in terms of softness minisol is definitely softer and less firm while they're both the same smoothness and they also absorb a similar amount of product when i used them but also when i used it because it's a bit softer it also blended in the product a bit more just a bit a tiny bit better than the isle away but honestly the difference is almost imperceptible you just need to expend a little bit more effort with the isle away than the mini soap I also tried using the Miniso sponge with the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. I tried to do that because the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer is very thick and drying on my skin and blended it with no issues. It was able to blend it into my skin seamlessly. It only became a bit harder to blend in the second layer and I had to use more of my fingers just to push the product in. I did notice that the Miniso blending sponge is just as soft as the BYS blending sponge that won in my last Beauty Blender dupes video. This costs 299 pesos or around $6 while this costs only 99 pesos. It's just as soft as the BYS one except that I distinctly remember that this was softer when I first started to use it and as I used it more it kind of got firmer and now they feel the same but this is just a tad smoother and i feel that this blends in the product easier or better than the mini soap blending sponge but the difference is very small and i would think that it's even imperceptible to others looking at your makeup so i do think that they are just the same or interchangeable and you won't go wrong with choosing this over this one I was also able to use the mini sauce sponge with powder to semi bake my under eyes and it worked fine. Out of the three, I recommend the mini sauce sponge the most. It did win against all of the other cheap beauty blender dupes. I definitely recommend the mini sauce beauty blender. It is worth the 99 pesos or even more. I think that it is a good substitute to the BYS Blending Sponge if you can't find that or if it's too expensive for you. I will definitely repurchase this one once I run out because I want to keep using it on clients and on myself. It works and I really like it. So thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye!